What's up YouTube, this is Prince of ATP 101 and in this video I want to show you guys another set of awesome tweaks. This is not a lot, but this is just something to get us over because there hasn't been a lot of tweaks being released. There's been a lot of jailbreak drama, but not a lot of tweaks and yeah, you know how that goes. So yeah, let's show you guys these tweaks. The first one I want to show you guys is called Compatting Mark. Compatting Mark, or a compatible mark, that's what it stands for. It's basically this right here. If you see certain tweaks has that blue check mark to the right or a yellow check mark just like that so basically what this is is based whenever you search for a tweak in Cydia it will show you whatever is compatible with the firmware that you're actually on at the time so not everything is compatible and not every tweak is updated for this format but the ones that are you could see that little check mark right there basically it will tell you if it's compatible or not so you could just go through and search for them and they're, they'll be in there. So if it comes with that blue and that yellow check mark, then you know you're good. So yeah, that one is called Compatty Mark. And the other one, this one is a real cool one. This one is called Don't Swipe. Don't Swipe is a tweet that lets you, say you show somebody a picture and you don't want them to swipe left. You could do a gesture, an activation gesture that it will just lock it right there. So I have my phone right now. Let's go to my camera. This is this, this just for example. So let's go right here. I took a screenshot today. And I don't want anybody to, if I show this to you, I don't want you to swipe up, swipe down. I want. I don't want you to do anything but look. So I'm going to shake my phone. And you see that little flash right there? Now you can't do anything with my phone. So I'm going to do that and give this to you and say, hey, take a look at this. But guess what? You won't be able to swipe left through my phone. You won't be able to do anything with my phone until I do the gesture again. Now I could scroll through shake it. I have it set up to shake so you can't do anything and then you can see I could do whatever so when you download this tweak don't swipe you're gonna get activator so this this is activator right here so we're gonna open up activator and I'm gonna show you guys how this is set up you wanna tap on anywhere and then you wanna choose whatever your activation method will be so you have the 3d touch could use your home button if your device have a home button lock unlock the vibrate button to the side whatever Apple watch it does so much but I use the shake so I have it set up for shake and whenever I shake it it's, it activates but you could also use the status bar or whatever you want to do the shake one is kind of obvious because if I shake it then give it to you you might I mean it's kind of obvious but you could just set it up for something really really simple like drag left to right I mean something like that and then you could just tap on it and then you could find whatever you want to set it up as so I could search for don't swipe boom right there and I tap on it and basically if I drag left to right it will do it but I'm gonna cancel that and that's how you set it up. Some people have said they were having um, issues with Activator, but Activator worked fine for me. And you guys could do a lot more with Activator. You guys could go in there and go to anywhere, just go to whatever you want to do and just set up certain gestures. You could set up gestures to open up apps, all that kind of stuff. But this one is just for the. And boom, you can't do anything with your phone. It's called Don't Swipe. Definitely check it out. And now I could do anything. And you get that haptic feedback and you also see the flash. So that one is real cool. Don't swipe. The next tweak I want to show you guys is called Hurry Up CC. Hurry Up CC is for your control center to speed it up and slow it down. So if I activate my control center, see how slow that is? But it goes away fast. But look at that. You see that? That's called Hurry Up CC. So if I go to settings, you guys could actually set it up however you like it. Where is it at? Should be right around here. So right now it's like that. So let's see if I bring it all the way down. And I'm going to go respring. Let's do it now. Now you can see it's faster a lot faster than before 
So yeah, that one is called Hurry Up CC. Basically, you could just slow down or speed up your control center. And then the other one I want to show you guys is called Latchkey. Latchkey is basically a lock screen tweak. Lock screen, lock screen tweak. So if you look in the left corner, you can see a little lock right there. So basically, if you want to get rid of the lock on the screen and have it more minimal, you could have that right there. And soon as it opens, like you could see, it's kind of fast, but you could see the, the the lock unlocks and then it opens. You could actually go on the settings and mess with it a little bit. You could have a setup where it shows you your the middle finger whenever it opens. So you could set it up over over you like it. You have the middle finger. You could have an octopus. You could set it up. However, right now it's just on the lock, but you could set up the middle finger. You could do, do a custom color. You could switch up the position, all that kind of stuff. Status bar, status bar right. I have it to the left, and you could have the whole thing hidden, and you guys could set it up however you like. So let's see if I have to respring. It's 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 it's, 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 it's too fast. Basically, it's really fast, so it's kind of hard to see. But whenever it opens, it just kind of it shows you the middle finger and all that kind of stuff so you guys could set it up however you like but it's actually a pretty cool tweak if you want a minimal um, lock screen the other one I want to show you guys is called palette palette is basically a notification center tweak so if I go to my notifications you can see oh, the Twitter ones so basically they go by the color of the app so you could see that you see there in red I'm gonna lock my phone real quick so I don't expose anybody. Come on, oh, I'm gonna swipe up. There you go. So basically, they will go by the colors. So the color of the app. I got a lot of Twitter. Wells Fargo, all that kind of stuff. So that's what Palette does. It basically just gives you different colors for different notification based on the color of the app and the other one and the last one I want to show you guys is called text emoji and this is the free version There's a paid one and a free version this is the free one so it's called text emoji so basically it gives you the option to preset certain emojis for certain commands or certain letters that you type so if I go to my text so I'm gonna set it up so this is it right here this is my test so what, I, what I'm gonna do I could type anything so I'm gonna go type what do I have I have some presets so basically you would go right here you would tap on those two dots and then you'll get a whole list of stuff that you could type so if I wanna type say I wanna type if I just type L then you could see the the smile the, the, the laughing face right there I mean so if I type S N see that I get the snack and you guys could go in there and switch it up and then you just have to type that and then you get the emoji so instead of searching for emoji you could just use this to get to it real quick so you guys could set it up however you like so if I go to settings scroll down where is it at you could see it right here so you could say they said download the full version because there is a paid version and then you have the custom codes right here so this is all the ones I set up so I have the S for that and then I have lit and there's a looking face and then you could just add another one just like that so you're gonna choose the emoji so I want to choose soccer and Jamaica for that one then I go to the code so I'm gonna just type in mm, let's see football I'm just typing F it should give me that for football. I'm gonna hit save. Let's go back into my text. So let's type in F. And there it is right there. You should show up in one of the options with the football. So that's how you do it. So this one is called text emoji. If you guys are into that, certain apps actually allow you to do this already. Certain apps will let you do this. So if you want to add that to your text or 
Now I mean you want to spice it up just to find the emojis real quick, your favorite emojis, even though they should be right in your um bar emoji, but that's a different tweak. So yeah, definitely try out these. And yeah, those are the tweaks, guys. I know it's not a lot, but this is just something to get us over on a Friday. There hasn't been a lot being released, but there has been a lot of jailbreak drama. So if you follow in Cool Star and all those guys, you see what I'm talking about. But yeah, that's about it. And they also update in Twitter right and not Twitter and um Cydia right now. Another important update. Remember the last one kind of messed up everybody device but this has been up for like a day now i haven't heard anything bad so let's update it and see what we get see if i break my city this has been done in real time and i might go live tomorrow guys i might go live if you guys want me to go live just let me know in the comment section below so okay so city is still there so that's good open it back up and seem to be up and running so yeah if you guys want me to go live I, I'm thinking about going live if you guys are down are you guys gonna watch let me know in the comment section and I wanna go live around hmm, in the afternoon sometime when everybody's up and running so yeah it's Prince of Day TP 101 definitely subscribe I'm almost at a at 20,000 subscribers so definitely hit that subscribe button I appreciate it peace thanks for watching